And then finally, um, you get to enjoy proven tangible results. So one, this is what customers want. Two, you can reposition your salespeople. Three, you can uh, allow for more complex and larger deals. And then four, um, you, we've got some great statistics here, um, all backed up by Forrester Research that uh, omni-channel customers, so those, uh, those are defined in these sources as being customers who work with you via a traditional sales channel, like a, a sales representative, or going through the B2B e-commerce website. Um, but those customers are more loyal than single channel customers. So if you have a human being and a great technology experience, those customers have a higher loyalty than those that are going through one or two of those, one of those channels only. The second thing is that uh, you can increase revenue and lower costs. You, you have me at hello, everybody wants this. So you have 52% lower order costs and 19% average sales growth being reported. And customers, um, when a company has gone from having no B2B e-commerce to having B2B e-commerce, they're reporting that their customers are spending more after migration uh, to that than they were before, um, which reinforces the, the uh, items above. And that's what we've experienced in our customers that we've moved this way also. And then finally, um, more traffic and brand exposure. If you have people coming to the site to do a task and not just a brochure site, if they're there to buy, um, most B2B businesses with e-commerce are reporting a 20% increase in web traffic after they deploy the commerce features. So, a uh, tremendous opportunity to, to gain and really win on all front, get increased engagement and traffic on the site. So those are the four main reasons um, that we recommend moving to B2B e-commerce and why many of you and, and or your competitors are already there.